So how does turning affect your aerodynamics? Is there a big effect there when it comes to how that air flows? It's a downforce is a function of velocity squared. At 50 miles an hour, your downforce is only one fourth of what it is at 100 miles an hour. And so in a slower corner, your downforce really doesn't make much of a difference. It's almost non-consequential. If you're up at BIR and you're in turn one, which is 120, 30 mile an hour corner, it makes a difference, right? It's, it's very meaningful. But when you're in the slower corners, 30, 50, 70 miles an hour, the actual impact is fairly modest at best. If you're racing and every little hundredths count, and we get back to that slice of bologna theory, is it helpful? Yeah, it's helpful. I'll, I'll, I'll take it. But I think that for, for most cars, and the Corvette C7 Z06, I think, is a great example of this. That car works wonderful on the track. But even the Z06 yeah. has a fairly aggressive upturn in the back. Yeah. But that's one of the reasons it does so well in many of these track applications because they got very aggressive with the arrow.